Yo, 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 and we're live. Welcome, everybody, to the stream today. Today, we're playing Small End, which is still in early beta access. But finally, finally, it's out. A lot of us have been waiting for this game a long, long, long time. And here it is. And so let's dive right in and start with a brand new game. Intrepid Vanguard, your queen is ill, gravely ill. This is why, as your king, I'm asking for your help. Venture into the overland and seek out a cure. Whatever the cost, be bold, be brave, remain vigilant. Hell yeah. And here we go. Bearded and cool looking. That looks dope. Cool lighting for sure. Greetings! I've been tasked with meeting all vanguards before they leave the burrows, as I have crucial information to impart. Keep an eye trained for those old effigies. They are scattered throughout the area and provide useful hints and tips to help you survive. Outside you'll find Captain Hearn. He will help you in your first days outside the burrows. Thank you. Harvesting! The overland is rich with natural resources and food and some, and some can only be harvested with the correct tool. You can craft different tools to harvest natural resources. Some resources can only be harvested with specific types of tools, so be sure to learn the best tool for the job. Press V to engage antenna mode in order to help you spot harvestable resources much easier. Ooh, yeah, that's gonna be super useful. So we got twigs, sprout. Can we do this? Unlimited amount of time? All right, doesn't cost anything. And we need to click it again to get out. Hey, we get some wood. And oh, we don't need tools to harvest resin. That's handy dandy. When you examine an old effigy, it reveals useful pieces of advice. This info is automatically locked into your compendium, which you can access at any time from the inventory menu. Cool, we got inventory. So we already got a wood club. Oh, we can equip it. Simple bandage. That's already crafting. Wood, fiber. Oh, we already started with two bandages. Okay. Mushroom steak. Get the map. All right. Pretty decent sized map. Of course, it's going to be expanded later on. We got here our mission. So the queen is ill. We got to go and save the queen. All right. That looks really beautiful. Press tab to open the inventory and select the codex. Yeah, we know all that. We already figured that out, Oli. Okay, I'm gonna pick up everything along the way since the first thing we want to do when we get out of here is to build a base. Hey guys, what's up? Food at the root barracks has become pretty stale lately. Luckily, my sister brought me some fresh insect eggs this morning. Mmm, that sounds yummy. My wife can make a mean pixie omelette. Pixie? What do you use? What, what's pixie? Oh, can I eat? Can I? You guys are cool with that? Thank you. Mold, mold everywhere. Yep. That's what you get from living underground. Make sure to search out these old effigies for useful information. Okay. I mean, so far they have been decent. Anything we can grab from you guys? There's a bunch more eggs. That's a really cool looking little cave base. Oh, that mushroom looks good. Nice so far. Can we build those? That's cool. I like a good co cozy sofa. Have you heard about the queen? Yes, yeah, she's sick, right? I pray to the sacred owl. She makes a full recovery. Well, I'm pretty sure we gotta do something to... What? Oh, I thought this thing's floating. I'm pretty sure we're gonna pay our part in that to save the queen. Oh, here we go. Hello. And the frame rate is dropping. All right, let's fix it a little bit. What you got? I wish I wasn't on night watch duty. The overland is dangerous enough place during the day. Well, you're pretty safe up here. Captain Hearn is stationed downhill from here. You should go and introduce yourself to him. Let's do that. And we got some more materials. There's some wood, twigs. Looks like we can easily get a lot of... Oh, there's more of these, right? Let me first get the stuff here. Let me get this one. Yeah, we have to get used to how these materials look like. Like, which you can harvest, which you cannot. Okay, what you got? 
Small folk are resourceful people. Tools, weapons, and food can be crafted out of the materials in the overland. Find crafting recipes to learn how to craft the new items. Typically, you will need a crafting station to craft new items, but every vanguard knows how to craft some basic tools and weapons without a workbench. Okay, so with G, we already figured that out. Oh, wait, you just click on it once? All right, that's dangerous to quickly overcraft. You don't even need to select it, you just click on it. And there's another, oh, armor provides protection. Yeah, we know that, that's fine. Hearn, greetings, Vanguard. Welcome to the Overland. I am Captain Hernest Manikabi, but most small folk call me Hearn. Yeah, that's easier. What can I do for you? I have some questions. Sure, what do you want to know? What's the Overland? The Overland is where we call the world on the surface. A very dangerous place. Here you won't find all the comforts of the burrows. You'll have to find food and construct shelter to survive. What tools should I craft? A wood club, builder's hammer, wood hatchet, workbench, fiber, wood. So keep your eyes peeled out on them. Okay. How do I build myself a shelter? With a builder's hammer. Okay. What can I find? Food! Mushrooms, wild strawberries. Creatures? Yuck! Sacred Owl, Vanguard. Have you never eaten anything but leaves? Some creatures' organs are delicious. Mmm, especially the liver. No, I, I hate liver. But it's healthy. And if you don't like them raw, you can always cook them. You should build yourself a campfire and try. Build a campfire? You need a builder's hammer for that. Once you have one, you can equip it to start building. Beware, weather in the overland can damage your constructions unless they're covered by a roof. That's good info. Can you craft some armor for me? Sure, but you will have to bring me all the necessary materials. Okay, we don't have anything yet. Padded bracers, breeches, wrap, light gauntlets, light leggings, like singlet. We just need fiber, that's all? We only need fiber for all of these. Okay, so this is better for cold because it's padded. But this one offers more... Oh, it gives us more movement speed. Interesting. All right, we don't have enough yet, so... Anything else? Oh, you can give me an assignment. Oh, yes, I've been expecting you. The Elder Ludwig has requested your presence. Go see him at once. He's staying in the cave just down the hill. All right, I think we're good then. All right, let's get this stuff here. And this stuff you this. There's a lot of stuff here, huh? It's cool that we can just pick it up and don't need to chop it down. Why is it still showing? Why does it show it's so offset? Oh, it's actually easier to see without. Wait, did I miss stuff the whole time? I only picked up half the whole time? I missed all this fiber, which we could have crafted armor. What? How did I miss all that? You could see it in here. Oh, so you can only see it. Okay, okay. So you, you harvest it, then he drops it, and then you have to pick it up. Ooh, that would have been useful to know a little bit earlier. Let's get, just get these chunks up here because I think there was probably a lot. And I thought our inventory was a little bit low. <laughs> God damn it. Who's, I think we can't swim yet, right? Yeah, I think we're drowning in the water. But I think they're gonna add that later. Stay away from deep water. <laughs> okay. Could have told me that a minute ago. Small folk can't swim. Upon death, you will respawn at your activated bat or spawn location. A tombstone will appear where before you died, uh, where you died. You must travel back to it to reclaim your inventory. That makes sense. <sighs> There's so much material. So that just means... They want you to pretty much instantly start building stuff pretty soon. So we gotta go in here and talk to the to a guy here. Ooh, yeah, you definitely look like an elder. What's up, Vanguard? Finally you here! Elder, what are you doing in this overgrown cave? The jeweled clover key that unlocks the apothecary's chest has gone missing. I fear it may have been stolen. We've been here trying to find some other means to open the chest. Who is the blah blah blah? Melka was the royal family's personal upper... Uh, what is that? Apothecary? Guess it's like a medic. In this case, we're standing 
It was his personal laboratory here in the Overland. He would spend countless days searching the Overland for rare ingredients for his potions. What's in the chest? The elixir of life claimed to heal any alignment known to small folks. So I guess we'll need that for the queen. Do you have any idea who might have the key? The key was locked in the royal vault, which is always under heavy guard. Only the king and I are allowed to enter. The theft was noticed when the queen became ill and the clover key was needed, but it could have happened some time ago. Well, you better keep track of your keys, buddy. Have you tried forcing the chest? We dare not. The chest is heavily reinforced and we would risk destroying the elixir within. I want to see that chest. I was told you requested my presence. Ah, oh, yes. We've received troubling reports from overland settlers in the forest. It seems as though some of the creatures in the area have become unusually agitated and aggressive. Seek out these settlers and investigate their claims. Does this have anything to do with the clover key? It is an interesting coincidence, but we have no evidence to suggest that there is a connection. You will find the settlers scattered throughout the forest. So, I whoa. There was an earthquake? Be careful, Vanguard. The wilderness is filled with danger. It's shaking again. Whoa. Okay, I shall leave now. I shall leave. I don't want to be in a cave while there's an earthquake. Okay, what is... Ah, uh, that's the... Is that the chest? Looks like a chest made of walnut. On the back, there's our uh, hinges. On the front, it has a strange cavity in the shape of four-leaf clover. Try to open it. If you try to force the chest, but it won't budge. Examine it. Looks like a chest made of walnut. Examine the cavity. You run your hand over the four-leaf clover cavity. The bottom section moves slightly when you press it. Push the button. Nothing happens. I don't think it's the puzzle, buddy. He just said nobody can open it, so... Let's go try to find that key. Well, it's dark here anyways. I think we can also craft torches. No, let's do that. Get a regular torch. And what is the torch? Is that the torch? Why does it look like... Oh, there's a little... Tool thingy over it. Oh, that's cute. Not bad. Not a bad torch. Interesting chest. That's really cool. That's, I like the idea of having a walnut chest. That's cute. All right. See you later, Elder. See you later, alligator. Is it getting dark already? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's getting dark already? Well, it didn't give us any time to build. Or am I just way too slow? I'm probably way too slow. Anyway, let's get some more resin. Wow, there's so much material everywhere. Okay, we got to focus on the story a little bit. Okay, what do you got? Uh, there are five different, different weapon types in the Vanguard. Can wield, blunt, edge, piercing, poison, and fire. The creature you encounter in Overland have different strengths. Okay, and different weaknesses. Got it. There's more wood. When you dismantle a structure, all the materials when used was originally built will be dropped and appear as collectible loot. Damaged structures can be repaired at no cost. Wow, that's very... Whoa, that's super nice. That we can just repair it. Uh, use bows and arrows to hit creatures from afar. You know, I think most of these things we'll probably start figuring out as we go. Um, we're starting to lose... It's already getting bright. So, maybe we should go up to that old... Okay. Small folk believe Oles possesses magical powers and worship them as some kind of divinity. Idol statues and decorations are crafted in their honor. Okay. Ooh, there's a bunch of egg. Blackberry. Yo, big old, can we talk to you too? Think I might have to be careful about fall damage. Do we were we not even supposed to come here? Let's see, can we go down here? Whoa! Yeah, we can. Let's see, that's probably really... Oh! We fell through the leaf. Oh, we can just pick up screws. Interesting. We can't go in the water. Oh, a key! Do we need a key? Well, it probably doesn't fit in the, in the chestnut. Oh, there's so much stuff. What is that? Bottle cap? Who throw who is littering in my forest? Oh shit, it actually 
Skip. Oh shit, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 there's ants. And I think they're in attack mode. Oh shit, I lost completely already orientation. Wait, there's the old tree? That's not the old tree. I have no idea where we are. There's the elder. Are we have? Do we have to go to Caleb? That hurt. Okay, we probably should not go in this cave. Hey, what's this? Hello. The spirit of... Oh, oh shit. That's coming. Spirit of the great tree is listening. What is it you wish? I want to claim this tree and make my camp here. Claim your first tree and make your encampment. You must climb to the top of the great tree. All right. You know what? Let's just do that. Let's climb this thing up. And I don't know where, but definitely got away from these ants. It's getting intense already. And they're just little ants. Oh! What? How can I tame you? How can I... Oh, at least he's friendly. Somehow we can tame these guys. What if I give you food? How can I just drop stuff? Can I not drop things? I can equip it. And then he's just eating it. Can I give it to you? You want a mushroom? Well, he probably doesn't want mushroom. He probably wants something a little bit more intense. We don't know how to craft material. So maybe first we gotta go and um, claim a tree? Not sure how it works. Let's try that. Let's just try to go up on that tree without dying. And Oh, he can climb. Can you climb up there? That's a pretty high. Okay. Okay, he can climb pretty cool. Ooh. All right, all right. There's definitely some room for error. But now what? Now what? The dead end. Or is it? No, it's not. Can I get up there? Yep, yep. Is that the top? Probably not. Whew. That's quite the way to go. Dun, 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 dun. dun. Yup. Whoop. Oh, wow. That's cool, though. We're already pretty up high. No! 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 I thought he could just run. Oh, no. We're all the way back here. Well. Wait. Did my backpack, though, drop? Because we died on the floor. Our backpack is probably on the floor. I thought it was... For some reason, I thought it's where we fall off. But... Fell off. Oh, no. Well, the compass says straight on. And then to the right. We're right over it. What? Or is it where we dropped? I think we dropped to the floor, right? That's really annoyingly hard to find. Oh, come on. Okay, let's try to fight. I should have used the axe. I should have used the axe. Oh, wait. You guys are actually really weak. Why am I running away from you guys? You guys are actually really, really weak. And we can make a campfire now. Uh oh, buddy, we're almost dead. We're almost dead. Well, I don't see a gravestone, so let's go up higher. Maybe it's just where we dropped from. So the good news, I think we kept our armor. Light singlet, padded. Okay, we keep what we were wearing. That's at least something. So let's go and get our backpack or our tube stone. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. Almost returned to the same spot. Oh, it's up here. All right. It's cool. Good to know that it, it lights up. 
All right. This time we jump. This time we jump. We don't just drop. It's getting dark already. Got to be careful this time. I mean, it's kind of nice that it spawns where you dropped from. Because you probably want to go back there anyways. But sometimes maybe you're in a tough spot and you don't want to go back up. Kind of annoying. Up this way. Hey! I think we made it. Hey, buddy. The spirit of the great tree is listening. What is it that you wish, Vanguard? I want to leave. <laughs> what? No. I want to claim this tree. You have claimed this great tree. Your tree encampment is private. What? This is pretty huge. So now we're here. Can we craft now? <gasps> no. Well, how do we... Did I miss one of these that was just really, really important? Because I don't have anything on here. No, we definitely missed something. Oh, wait. We need to use the ham. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You need to equip the weapon you use for the crafting. So we got foundations. Oh, cool. We got curved walls and roofs. Decorations. And a campfire workbench. So we definitely want a workbench. Let's do this first. Cool. Now we can make bandages. We'll definitely need... Let's make some bandages first. Okay. That's kind of dope. Um, But I want to focus more on building a house real quick. And then we got some placement options. Uh, snapping on off and a grid of 170, 140. Oh, we just lost something. Oh, wait, we're out of, we're hungry. We don't want to die from, uh, food, from hunger. Let's just build a tiny house first. Except we can put a roof over. Okay, can you place this here? Man, this is the tiniest house ever. And then we make a roof. Hello, snap. This doesn't look like it's in the right spot. Let's just make her a flat roof. Whatever. That's fine. One. And two. And three. And four. And now can we make a bed? Sure. All right. Respawn point set. You fall in deep slumber. Yes, and we survived. Uh, no, we died already the first day, but we have the most boring little shed here. But it does look kind of cool. So cool. We got a house. We got a bed. We got a workbench. Let's maybe... Okay, the, the building is confusing that you need to select the hammer in order to build stuff. And let's make the fireplace can we make it inside i mean that shouldn't be smart but let's see if anything happens to the building seems like it might be fine um so we can make an ant skewer cool grasshopper legs mushroom steak that means grasshoppers are probably not that bad to kill not that difficult to kill wait we just make it instantly make a chest up here this chest looks nice and we get the bed. Cool. Nice. So let's put some of our wood and stuff here. And can we make a torch? No, we have to equip the items. Okay. That's a bit annoying, but it's cool. So we need this and we need some wood. And then we craft. Let's make two torches. We can only make one. Six? It needs six, uh, five wood and five resin? Yo, those torches are heavy. Insufficient materials. Oh, because we need fiber. That's a bit annoying. I hope they fix that in the future to allow us... Huh? 
use it? Why can't I use the chest? What's going on? Hello? Wait, hello? I can't use the chest. Is that a bug? No, let me open my chest. I can use everything else, but I can't use the chest. What? Repair? Well, it's not broken. What if we hit it? Okay. Repair. <gasps> no, I can't. <laughs> what? Why can I not access my chest? That's stupid. So that means I can't really... I wanted to test if we can place the foundation everywhere. Wait, how high can we go? Whoa, we can go all the way on these ones? That is... Whoa! Okay. So there's a dead ceiling for sure. It hit... That's crazy. We can build this whole thing together. Across all these branches. That's really cool. I actually want to build my base up here. That's cool. And it's also nice that we can break things down uh, without losing any materials. And we can repair them at no cost. Ooh, advanced rotation mode. Yeah, looks like I placed these walls maybe the wrong way. But hey, come on, it was dark, okay? So we got this. We're pretty bad on food and everything. Um, I wonder if we should craft some weapons. I really want a shield or something. I also need to learn about the combat. Because you can, like, block. So we can dodge. That's probably the most useful in the whole combat. Hey, buddy. Are you are you cool that we're living together here now? I'm going to unclaim, make it public. No. So who are you, my friend? The tree butler. Hello, Vanguard. What can I do for you? Take me down to the root level, please. I'd like to ask you something about the great tree. Sure, I'm all ears. How can I let other small folk build a migrate tree? How can I prevent? How can I take man? Okay, we don't need to know this right now. Take me down. Take me down to the root level, please. Whoa. And it's fast. Ooh, I like that. I like the speed of it. I was a bit afraid that it might be very slow and every time you have to do that, it's, it's annoying. But that's actually cool. Yo, nice. Um, I just realized what I messed up. I should have made more bandages. Because we're probably going to die pretty soon. Hey, dude, are you happy now that we claimed the tree? Okay, you can make it public from here, too. I think we're fine. Oh, no, we're not. Wait, what was blocking? Who else? Where are you? Come here. Come here, let's fight. Why can't I sprint? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, you can't sprint on this ship? <laughs> you can't sprint on here? What? Why? So we don't really have an exact mission. We just need to find that key. And Caleb. Is that where we started? I guess so. We crossed the water. No, we didn't. This is where we spawned. That's our tree. Here's the elder. Here's the guy we... So we started the game somewhere here. So let's just go to Caleb. There's some ladybugs. I wonder if we kill one. Are they gonna... Oh, they're not even attacking us. They're just running away. Come away, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. I mean... Whoa. Grasshoppers cruising through. Come on, stay here. They're fast. So we definitely need a bow and arrow to kill these until we get faster. Yay! Sorry, buddy. Insect fat. So what can we do with that? Price for its rich, creamy texture, insect fat adds a unique flavor to baked goods. Use this common ingredient in recipes for cakes, pie. Okay, so we can use it for cooking. Should we try? Yeah, why not? What's up, dude? 
I mean, I kind of want to ride you. Okay, let's try to block him. Come on. Ouch. Ouch. Dude. Okay, he's tougher than I thought. Ow. Where's the... I gotta remap that roll. Okay, okay. Maybe I'll just leave you alone. Okay, he killed us. <laughs> he killed us. All right, we're dead. Pretty challenging first day. I'm going to call the live stream here um, and I'm going to play a bit more offline to get used to controls and everything and remap my keys because there's a couple things I'm not exactly happy with. Um, so thanks, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye-bye.